what an average day in our homeschool life looks like. This is our typical Thursday. Time to get Daniel up and bring his clothes. Wake up. Time to wake up and go to school, Daniel. Good morning. Can I have a hug? <laughs> Alright, get dressed. We can go to school, okay? Even Hattie and Daniel really like this hot sauce. Wear this harness on the bus so he doesn't get out of his seat. Here's your backpack. Driving down the bus, Daniel, down the big driveway. What are we waiting for? Who's coming? The bus? Can I go to school? Can you say school? Bye, Daniel. <laughs> Off he goes. Hey. 6.55. So now it's 7.04. I'm gonna go running. The house is really quiet, which is awesome. And I'm going on my run. I'll probably do about four miles and come back and be ready for breakfast chaos. All right, good morning, boys. Wake up. Devotions in five minutes. Sam, it's a great day to be an Erdner. Hey, wake up. With the unlimited good morning, family, Enoch. Time to wake up. As well. Would you like to learn more? Uh, today we're going to read from Ephesians chapter 4, verse 29. It's one of my favorite verses in the whole Bible. Let his glory above to bear it to dark cavalry. And we pray all this in the name of Jesus. Amen. So I made it back from my run just in time for devotions. I ran a half marathon on Sunday, and today is the first run I've done since then. 8.03. Run is done. Devotion's done. Coffee, the lifeblood of a mother. Yay. I pledge allegiance I to the flag, the flag of the United, United States, States of America. America. I'm going to do my Bible study and have my coffee. And I'm going to fall asleep. And Jed's doing some school. He doesn't feel too good today, but he's going to do his school. Jed's taking a break while he's waiting for me to help him with the spelling test. Here comes Nina. It's about nine o'clock. Doing math and singing along to the music. All right, I'm gonna lay on the couch and read a book with Tobes. It's the Bird Guide of North America. That's what we're reading. This is my bullet journal, so it keeps me organized. So this is my schedule for today. Here's some of the stuff I have to do. So there we go. Busy day. Explode the code with Hezzy. They're waiting for me. You know which one is a rod? Right, like a fishing rod, good. You say rod? Rod. Rod, okay. What's the next one say? What are you doing? I'm on the bench. Oh, what letter is that, do you know? Y, 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 Y. Yep, good job, buddy. You wrote 16, 16, 18, 19. Uh oh. <laughs> fix that. Honey, now you wrote 16, 18, 18, Oh, that. Yay, you got it right this time. Thumbs up. <laughs> 12.10, time for lunch. Leela's helping Just me make up. lunch. Are you going to make your sandwich, Hattie? Yeah. What's on it? Cheese. Cheese, and what else? Meat. Always 
always use bacon on your eggs and milk. Always use milk. It is 12.35 and we are leaving for therapy. I have to eat Good luck. the road. Now I'm babysitting the kids. It's 2.44. We just got home from speech therapy. This is what happens when I leave for a little while um, and a teenager is in charge at home. Okay, Hattie, count for me. Taking a break. Then after three, I'm gonna leave with Jed. Eden and Hattie are reviewing their alphabet. Toby needs to get his soccer cleats on, right? For soccer practice, we're gonna do a bunch of driving. People everywhere. Bus driver's coming, gotta go get Daniel. Heading down to get Daniel off the bus. Hopefully I'm not late. Yeah, I'm late. How was school today? Good? Did you have a good time? We have to go in the van. That's the wrong foot. 3.45, we're about to head out to drive all over town in a million directions, and I need another cup of coffee. Uh, we're going to uh, martial arts. First, cook soul. For Simeon and Jed. And then we're going to drum lessons. Successfully got to cook soul without killing anybody. Uh, next, stop. next stop. Drums. 4.30, right on time. There we are. Okay, just made it to Cook Soul to pick up the boys. Their class ends in three minutes. Three, two, two one. All right, you're not back out on the floor. 10 push-ups. Next stop, soccer. Uh-oh, pick it up. You don't have a ball or water or anything? Go on, Toby. Run like the wind. Okay, 6.04, we just dropped off Simeon. I have Eden. Hattie's in the car, hi. hi. Daniel's in the car, that's all that's left, and we're going home. I'm probably just gonna go home and I'll feed these guys, and then when everybody else gets home, they can eat. It's just one of those days. Just made it home, 6.25 or so. Okay, so we just got home at 6.25. Um, the only kids home right now are Eden, Hattie, and Daniel. We're gonna get them having their dinner so they can get ready for bed. They go to bed a little earlier. So I get a little breather before more chaos. Eden, Hattie, and Daniel are eating their dinner. Yummy, yummy. Okay, they're getting home, 6.59. How was practice? You ready for some dinner? We have someone who's a little tired here. Everybody's still eating over here. Almost 7.30, time for Daniel to go to bed. Toby's gonna brush his teeth. It's 8.40. Simeon's home, Daddy's home. Goodness we're going to bed, these two, we're going to bed. I love you, are you tucked in tight? Kind of. <laughs> okay, all right, Eden's already asleep, but. Good night, Hattie! <laughs> okay, 9.17. Oh my gosh, Simeon's smoothie just exploded. <laughs> <laughs> Champion, two games to none. I'd let him win because okay. embarrassing. I said I beat him the past few days, and I just feel like he needs some. I he needs some. Game. Two games to oh, zero. No. All right, almost ten fifteen. Time for y'all to go to bed. Okay, it's ten forty-five, and I actually crossed off most of the things on my list today. That never happens. Okay, that's it. All the kids are in bed. So that's a day in the life. It's usually this crazy. Different things go on every day, but that's a good sampling of what our life is like.
Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed our crazy day. And if you did, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and be ready for more. Thank you.